Happy Halloween, everybody. This is Brandon's Movie Corner, and it's time for a DVD, Blu-ray, and 4K Ultra HD update for Halloween of 2022, or October 31st, 2022. And over the past couple weeks, I got six DVDs, four Blu-rays, and one 4k ultra hd even though this one is a pretty interesting release and you'll see why when i show it now to start off i'm going to show the two dvd box sets that i received from amazon on tuesday october 18th which was actually the day they were released and i did pre-order them back at the end of august and here they are Now, even though this is advertised as the complete series, there are actually a few missing episodes on this set. From what I hear, the ones that are missing are the holiday specials and the TV movie, Edda and Eddie's Big Picture Show, which serves as a series finale. Which is a shame, but it is what it is, I guess. And I also do have the individual Season 1 DVD of Ed and Eddie, but since I have this complete series set now, I'm probably going to end up getting rid of the individual Season 1 DVD at some point. It does come with the episode guides I'll show in a minute. And here's the episode guide. Oops. And I do remember watching both Edda and Eddie and Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends on Cartoon Network as a kid. And this also comes with an episode guide, which I'll show in a second. And I'm not going to pull each disc out to show them individually because... The discs are hard to get out, and I don't want to break them by accident. Yeah, I'm not really a fan of the packaging for this one. I, I like the packaging for the Edda and Eddie set better, but it is what it is. And here's the episode guide. Now, the next three DVDs I got at Walmart on Thursday, October 27th. And these are all Mill Creek Entertainment DVDs, and they come in VHS-styled slipcovers.
and the last DVD I ordered on it I ordered from eBay on Tuesday October 25th and I received it today I do have all the other um, Nickelodeon Shout Factory compilation DVDs, so I figured I'd get this one too. And to my knowledge, this DVD is a Walmart exclusive. And it did have a Walmart price sticker on the shrink wrap when I received it in the mail today. And now on to the Blu-rays. The first one is the one that I got at Walmart on Thursday, October 27th. And I saw this movie in theaters back in August. Really enjoyed it. I was originally going to get the 4K Ultra HD release of this movie. But it was out of stock at my Walmart. So I thought I'd just get the regular Blu-ray instead. Which I'm fine with. Now this next one I received in the mail on Saturday, October 22nd. And if I remember correctly, I ordered it on October 19th. It was either the either the 18th or 19th, but I forget. And this one is exclusive to A24's online shop. So you cannot get this one in stores. And this is a movie I've been wanting to check out. I was going to try to see it in theaters, but the Cinemark Theater in my area was not showing it for some reason. But now that I have this blur, I, I will plan on checking this movie out sometime soon. They also do have a 4K Ultra HD version on the A24 shop as well, but that comes with just the 4K disc and does not come with a Blu-ray disc, so that's why I got the regular Blu-ray version. And it also does come with this booklet, which I will um, flip through a little bit of it so you get an idea of what it looks like, but I'm not gonna show the entire thing. And I'm gonna have to put this down for a second so I can put it back in. There you go, sorry that took a little while. And this next one is from the Criterion Collection and I ordered this from Criterion.com's 50% off flash sale on October 11th and I received it on October 14th. And I saw this movie at my Cinemark Theater back in April 2021 during their Oscar movie week. Very, very good movie. And the spine number is... 1151. And this movie was produced by Amazon Studios and it was available for streaming on Amazon Prime Video. But I actually had the chance to see it in the theater, like I said.
Here's what the inside of the case looks like. And the last regular Blu-ray I received from Amazon today, and this is one I pre-ordered last month, and I received it today on its release date. And I saw this movie in theaters on my 25th birthday. And this was an awesome, awesome movie. And I think I may have liked this one a little bit more than the original Top Gun, actually, even though the original Top Gun is so awesome. I think this is one I'm definitely going to rewatch sometime soon. Because if some of you saw my community tab posts, I named this my number one favorite movie of 2022. And the reason why I got the standard Blu-ray is because, as some of you know, Paramount, um, with their 4K releases, they usually have just the 4K disc by itself and not and not the regular Blu-ray. Even though I did hear there is a Steelbook release of this, which, on 4K, which is bundled with the regular Blu-ray copy. But I'm fine with this standard Blu-ray release. And now for the 4K um, Ultra HD, which I picked up at Walmart on October 27th. And this is something kind of unusual. This is a 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray and DVD combo with the digital code. And it's packaged in a DVD case. They had this for a few other Paramount movies as well. And there was a sticker on it saying only at Walmart, so this um, particular release is apparently a Walmart exclusive. Yeah, I have never seen something like this before. Yep, here's the 4K Ultra HD disc, which is from 2022. The Blu-ray disc, which is from 2017. And the DVD, which is from 2006. And there's the code if anyone wants it. Same with all the other digital codes I showed in this video. And that's going to do it for this DVD, Blu-ray, and 4K Ultra HD update for Halloween 2022. This is Brains Movie Corner signing off, and have a happy Halloween.